All right, welcome back. You're watching the Fox 9 Morning News on this little bit drizzly Saturday morning. It's really not that bad out here. You know, there's a football border battle day. It's Vikings football. It's Twins baseball. Perfect time for grilling. And let's get those dads to do a little cooking this weekend. And Rob Barrett from CookingForDads.net is here, is back. Welcome back. Good to be always here. Good always. Oh, we've got a lot of, uh, I'm not going to say manly ingredients, but uh, we've got <laughs> Summit beer. We're cooking with Coca-Cola. We've got sharp sticks. Yeah, sharp uh, sticks are good. And knives and big pieces of meat. Yes. Yeah, so <laughs> so time well, for guys it's to perfect. Cook. Actually, this is these are all ideas for tailgating for the weekend. So if you're okay. going to, uh, I heard there's some sports this weekend. <laughs> yeah, just like one I thing know, happening. Something about a Paul Bunyan's axe or something. Mm -hmm. I'm not sure. We're going to cook up some badger meat here. You can get this at your <laughs> local game store. <laughs> Be sure to ask for a badger. Yeah, actually, this is flank right steak. Right next to the bald eagle. This is great. We're going to put all of our stuff on sticks so you don't need any utensils. At the game, all right. Those skewers, we're going to marinate them with this. In fact, this is a flank yeah. steak. If as long as you cut it across the grain like this, mm -hmm. it just flakes right off when you once you cook it. Otherwise, so then, you're going to be shredding it. All right. Then you're going to be yeah. Okay, so I'll it. put this on oh. there. You want to get your hands all full of meat. Full of meat. Okay. I'll do that. Then we'll get, here's a variety of different ideas for what Look to do this. with it. First of all, love this. This let's do a little beer marinade. All right. We'll put it in here. Need so, some beer. This works with beer or with Coke. Pour the beer in there. How much? Just all of it. Well, yeah, we need to actually, reserve some. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> put that in there, and then put in a handful of chopped onions. All right. Then we're going to marinate our meat. Boom. Just like that. Well, actually, what I like to do it's is better get a stand up. A, a, a soda bottle or even like a milk bottle like that. Put your skewers in, pour idea. the stuff over the top. Your handles stay, stay clean. When you're ready to go to the game, you're just going to put it in a plastic bag, seal it up, and you're ready to go. That's that easy. For that plastic bag, we're going to add just a little rub to get all over that beer. It's going to okay. be really good. So take two spoonfuls of brown sugar. All right, do I put that back in the bowl? Put this in our, our pre moistened bowl. <laughs> pre moistened. Uh, all right, a some spoonful salt. of salt. Oh, a spoonful? All right. Yep. And then a spoonful of pepper and a half spoonful of paprika. You can just dump that in. Stir that around. That right. is our rub. We're going to put that in a plastic bag like this, and we're going to put our stuff in there and shake it around. It's going to coat our marinade. You know, there's nothing wrong with just basic salt and pepper. And, right. But if you want to do something special, well, here's you're going to be idea. at a tailgating party. You don't get to do that every day. Right. The idea is to do this at home so that when you get there, all you have to do is take it out, put it on the grill. You don't want to be doing a lot of mixing. And is there anything that a Ziploc bag can't do? No, that absolutely That is the best, one nothing. of the best tools for cooking. All right, here's another idea. This is more okay. like an, an Asian satay thing. Pour in half of the uh, Ooh, coconut, coconut milk. milk. All right. This is a two spoonfuls of curry powder. Dump that in Ooh. two spoonfuls. This is a spoonful of salt, spoonful of sugar, and then this is some a coriander. Mortar and pestle. I couldn't find the, the bottle, so I had to break it up. Wow, this so we is, got fresh. Right. So then it was you stir that up like this. You got to smell that. A little brown sugar in there won't hurt. Well, you know, and people, a lot of people probably don't cook with the coconut milk. That's more of a Thai, isn't it? Thai recipe. Yeah. Oh wow! Yeah, with that's an amazing thing. Milk. All right, S so you same, can do that. same technique then. Yep, put in that in here. Pour that over. Uh, chicken or beef, or what are you talking about? Chicken for or that? beef or shrimp. It's really good. Anything. Oh. This is more of a beef recipe. Okay. You can do it with chicken because the, the the rub is really strong. Mm -hmm. But really, that's more of a that's a manly beef oh, yeah. beer thing. Uh, the women can eat it too. But. Yeah, it's it's okay. All right. This is just an easy teriyaki sauce. You oh. do one part soy sauce, one part sugar, and then just a little bit of of ginger. Slice that up. Bring it to a boil, pour it over. Mm. It is amazing. You're gonna have some a little bit. All right. If you want one to be really simple, this is just uh, lighthouse Pretty sesame made. ginger uh, salad dressing. Salad dressings were great. Mm -hmm. You can do Italian or an Asian thing like this. Do that. Little salt and pepper. Squeeze that on, and you are good to go. Well, you can, and it, obviously, this is stuff that people can do in, in an instant. Right. Just about, I mean, obviously, you're gonna to want to prepare that. You know, have the meat thawed and have the skewers and things like that done. But this stuff you just throw in the bag and bring with you. You are set. If you want to do onion rings, you can do that. You can do a, a oh, skewer of, of, tomatoes. Uh, of tomatoes if you want to get, be healthy. So the onion rings, you can actually cook them on the grill. I, yep. mean, I guess they're already cooked. If, right. If just brush them with some olive oil. So they don't stick. Put them right on about four or five minutes aside. Flip them over. This is the Coke. This is the, um, this oh. is the teriyaki here. Oh, with, it's all done? Yep. It should be ready to go. And it should just come right off. There you go. Oh, nice. Isn't teriyaki. That fun? Teriyaki See, this is great. It doesn't, doesn't make any sense, Rob. Because we're oh, good. Here, That's well, what I was hoping for. How, e a, it's how easy it is. But we're here in the parking lot of the station eating, and Eric is out tailgating. Yes. And he's not getting any food or grilling. No, no. But we want, before we toss things over to Eric, I want to let you know, we're going to put these awesome recipes on our website, myfox9.com. But you can also go to Rob's, cook, uh, Rob's helpful advice site, cookingfordads.net. There's video tutorials on mm -hmm. how to do all this stuff. Man, again, this just isn't right. It's so good. Hey, Eric, if eating this is right, I don't want to be wrong. Or if eating this oh. is wrong, I don't want to be right. I think that's how it's yeah, supposed you're, to be. Yeah, you should try this one. You're the lucky one. I mean, yeah. I'm, I'm next to all the tailgaters. So this you're is, this the is one terrible. The you're double fist.